as you can see, guys, in this video, I got some food. Now, in my last video of Double Mac, everybody stated that they want to see me eat more food. We're just going to go for it, okay, y'all? I ain't trying to kill myself. I ain't trying to hurt myself. So I just got a little lightweight, light work right here. We're going to be doing some McDonald's. This is my very first mukbang video. Um, not McDonald's, but Taco Bell. I'm sorry. It's just etched into my mind. I'm still eating them burgers, honey. Them burgers was a nightmare. But I'm going to go ahead and eat some Taco Bell for you guys. So I got me a drink. This is my son's drink. So we're going to see how this goes. I've never done a mukbang before. This is my very first one. So I ordered for myself because in a mukbang, they want you eating a lot. I ordered a Chalupa box and a Grande, well, no. I ordered a Chalupa box and a, I don't see the other thing that I, oh, a triple, a triple, a triple Lupa or something like that. Is this three chicken pieces and chicken for the taco shell and it's cheese and meat and blah, blah, blah. Andre, here's your drink. You can have that. So let's go ahead and take out this food. And let's just go ahead and get started. Now, I told them to put about 20 uh, sauce packets uh, of each flavor. So let's just hope they did what I told them to. I don't see what this is. Okay, you can have that. And we're going to go ahead and get started. Okay, this is the triple lupa right here. Oh, I didn't, did I pick chicken or steak? I don't know if I picked chicken or steak, but this is how big, this is pretty big. Y'all, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to eat all this food now. Y'all got me doing stuff that I know I can't do. I ain't never been no big eater, ever in my life. I might end up crying at the end of this video. Just let just say that. So hopefully I uh, can put it where y'all can see it. I'm gonna break my box down like I always do. Mm, hold on. I might want some pico de gallo on this. So I'm going to open that up. And yes, y'all can see that. Pull this stand up just a little bit closer. And I'm going to put this one right here. So this is what I have to eat. I have a... Um... I think this is the soft shell taco. This is the hard shell taco. Oh, it's broke. I'm mad about that. This is the Oh no, this is the soft shell taco right here. Uh oh, I got Fritos in there. Ugh, I might not like that. I don't know if I'm gonna like that one. But we gonna see. I'm gonna try it. So the first thing I want to do before I eat is pray over my food because we don't know whose hand has been uh, trying to prepare this. Christian Lord, we thank you for this food we're about to receive. We ask you to bless it and sanctify it for the health and the nourishment of our bodies. In Jesus' name, I thank you. I praise you. Amen. People think you always got to close your eyes when you pray. No, you don't. Or you can pray doing whatever you want to do. Or you want to bow your head, bow your head. You want to look around the room, do it. Because the devil is always on the tag. You can see it moving if you open your eyes. This is all the sauces, but y'all probably can't see that part. I got about a thousand sauces here. Because I didn't want to run out of choices. <laughs> Alright, so I'm I think I'm gonna start with the dang. I don't know where to start. Is this chicken or is this some kind of soft pita bread? Mm -hmm. I never had this before, mind you. It's supposed to be chicken. This ain't pita. That's not chicken. That's why I ordered it. I thought this look, was chicken. Look, mine is. This? I thought this was chicken. That's why I ordered this. Y'all, I done steer myself wrong. So, I'm going to take some fire sauce. Because I like very hot, spicy foods. I'm going to take a fire. And I'm going to do a hot I got Diablo too. Under the camera's turned. 
Mm. You know, I'll turn it that way a little bit. You want to see how it's crooked? How about now? You got to squeeze the legs together right there. Like that. Okay. So, I did also order instead of a soda. Because last time with that meal, that McDonald's meal, I had a soda. Knowing I didn't need no soda. And it hurt me back. It's something serious. So, with this meal, I got a strawberry Skittles smoothie or slushy. Brain cream. So, let's go ahead and take the first bite of this. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, y'all, this is good. It's pita bread. I thought this was that chicken chalupa. But I tricked, I didn't pay attention and this is what I got. It's still good. But I just didn't want that bread. Because I got the soft shell. Of course, I can't have a lot of bread. I don't supposed to. Mm -hmm. So we're going to see how much of this type of guy I can eat, y'all. Go. What are you talking about quarantine? How is that going for everybody? I don't feel no pain. One thing about me is this. I'm more of a homebody. So, I don't have no friends. I don't have any family members that I associate with or I hang out with. So, being in the house... I ain't missing out on nothing. I don't really go to clubs or I really don't do any adult late night activities, period. Um, I ain't missing nothing. <laughs> do I get bored? Yeah, I do. I get very bored. But the things that I be wanting to do other grown-ups would consider boring. I don't like to do what everybody else is doing. Well, yeah. therefore, I keep to myself because what I think is fun is weird to other people. And what other people think is fun, I think is just stupid and pointless. Like going to the same club. Over and over, every weekend, you got the same dry music, you got the same dry people, you got them same dry dancers, you got the same ones that can't dance, they still ain't learned how to dance, they've been dancing for five, ten years, you've been in the club dancing forever, you still ain't learned how to catch the beat? Mm-mm. Girl, I ain't looking at you. I ain't gonna look at you every weekend. No. No. Mm-mm. No. I hate the smell of smoke. Um, I drink every blue moon, like on certain occasions. But I like drinking red wine. I don't want to sit up and be boozed up with beer. I do like Patron, though. I ain't even gonna trip. I take me, I take me a little Patron. You know what I'm saying? Squeeze that lime in there. Pour me some cherry juice in there. Boom! That's my drink. That's my signature drink. Try it. You don't see why? Why I drink it? I love it. I'm not no alcoholic, but it's good to me. That's what I like. So <clears throat> that that taco right there wasn't too bad, y'all. That one was actually pretty decent. I just didn't have no taste for that that bread. I really actually wanted it to be. Um, I actually wanted it to be chicken because I had to taste for some chicken. Mm -hmm. So. Now I'm just now I'm going on with the hard shell taco and I'm just using the fire. I like to mix fire and hot. Really, I could just use Diablo because it feels about the same as the Diablo when you mix the fire and the hot. I don't I, yeah, that's just what I'm getting. That's what my taste buds doing. So I gotta try to piece back my taco together. Cause it didn't fell apart and had a breakdown. Mmm. 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 But do you hear that crunch? Mm-hmm. Do you hear that crunch? 
I know you do. Mm. 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 Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It's just a taco, y'all. Everybody know what Taco Bell regular hard shell taco tastes like. It's good. Okay. Mm. Even though at one point I did say I never eat Taco Bell again. Why? You may ask. Because to me, it seemed like they want to portray themselves to be affiliated with the Illuminati. And I don't like that. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you do, do you. Don't bombard us with it. We don't want to be a part of that. We just want to eat some good food. We want to let everybody know that you're affiliated. Okay. When you burning in hell, can you send a memo out from hell and say, hey, y'all, don't do it. You can't do that. Can't do it. So, oh, no, that one's good, y'all. I'm going to tell you right now, I don't know if I'm going to be a good mukbanger because I'm stuffed already. I don't know if I can go on, but I'm going to try to go on. Okay, let's just try. Well, let's see what, what this thing is giving. This is the Trilupa. And I swear I just wish this was chicken, y'all. I could do better if this was chicken. I, I probably really could. So this trilupa looks like it has a lot of melty cheese, like nacho cheese. I see lettuce. I see tomatoes. I see shredded cheese. I see seasoned beef. And it looks like it's um, another kind of sauce on here. I don't know what that is. But on this one, I'm going to go ahead and put Diablo to Diablos because of the simple fact that Fire and hot makes Diablo anyway. So, I'm going to go in with Diablo. Mm. It's all the same. It's hot. Hot sauce. And I could drink a bottle of uh, red hot, so it don't do me no... It don't, it don't do me no... Nothing bad. I don't do nothing bad to me. I can do it. Oh, Lord God. Be with me. What? You didn't know it's Diablo? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of them. I got 15 to 20 packs of each. All right. So I will tear it apart, but I'm just going to eat it all like this. Mmm. 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 What? Wait a minute. What is that sauce? Mmm. Mmm. Now, wait a minute. Y'all see how this food falls in there where... Y'all feel this food falling everywhere? This is what I was talking about. When I'm talking about sauce, look at look at that. Look how it's hanging out. Mm. Feel round from the finger. This is what you want your food doing. You want it licking. You want it dripping. You want it coming down. Mmm. 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 I got sauce lips. I got sauce everywhere. Yeah, I don't see no more size. You know what I'm saying? Why can't you see her? Being a good, good girl. Just staring around the kitchen. She ain't asking for no food. She ain't doing nothing. Because she know she ain't getting none. She know I don't need her table food. That's one thing I try to tell people. If you have pets, especially dogs and cats, y'all don't feed them the food that you're eating on your table. The reason being is because you didn't season that food. That seasoning could be hurting their digestive systems or their stomach. You don't know if that what it's doing to them inside. We're made to eat seasonings. They're not. Mm. So if, if I'm eating something and she seems like she's looking like, oh, I want some, I give her vegetables, fresh vegetables. She loves carrots. She loves sweet potatoes, which is very good for her. She loves bell peppers. <clears throat> I let her eat stuff like that. Now, after I get done with this, oh, I'm going to be putting me some greens in the crock pot for tomorrow. So, once I start picking and cleaning them, I'll feed her. I'll give her stuff like that for a treat, uh, or I'll put it to the side for her to have it for a treat. But she loves stuff like that. 
Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. Whatever the Trilupa sauce is, look, look at all that. It is delicious. I'm just gonna tell you, it's really good. Mmm. Mmm. See? Well, you can't control it. That's a good mom sauce. I can't control this sauce. I can't control it. Dang, I need so many nap napkins. Ooh, I think I'm at the mat. I told y'all, I ain't no good mug manga, y'all. I'm not, because I can't. My stomach feels like I'm nine months pregnant as we speak. And it's probably looking like that, too. You know. Y'all trying to ruin my summer body. Y'all think I don't know it. You think you slip. I ain't going. Mm -mm. I plead the blood of Jesus over my intestines right now. That they will empty out everything that I put in in a timely, quick manner. Okay? I'm going to do that. Hmm. I will say this though, this strawberry Skittles slushy worth it. Now, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna front. Cherry is my favorite flavor, period, hands down. But they did not offer that, so I had to get something else that was red because I'm fascinated with red. It's my favorite color, and for some reason, when I'm eating and drinking things that are red. In my mind, I feel like it tastes so much better because it's red. Yeah, see what I'm saying? I'm weird. That's why I hang out with people. Hmm. 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 That's why, also, I mix fire and hot because the color of the packages. I really don't like using Diablo because it's black. Is that weird or is that not? I'm just saying, do you? That's how I feel. I've always done that. That makes fire and hot. Hmm. Well, I know you're saying, you're You're gonna drink on that drink? Yeah, I am. And you know what? It's 2.52 in the afternoon. So you know what that means? After I done scarfed all this food down and drunk my slushy with pride, I'm going to have to just keep moving around for the rest of the day. Ain't no more snacking. Ain't no more treats. Ain't no more none of that for me. This is it. This is all I'm getting. So I'm going to enjoy it. You know, while I got the chance. You know, I'm going to try to eat a little bit more of this food. Because I know them mukbangs, they be going hard and heavy. Eating big stacks of food this hot. I ain't got no fat but stack food that hot. I'm just going to eat what I can. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Mm. I just can't do it. I can't force myself to do it. Y'all, I can't do it. It's in this video. Mm -mm. I don't know how them people do that. I'm not doing it. I'm full. So, let's go over what I've done. <clears throat> I took on a chalupa, which I thought was chicken. Oh. And I took on a whole hard shell taco. Anybody can do that. Light work. I took on one and some quarters of a set. Well, matter of fact, I'm just going to eat the whole thing so I can say two sections. I, I, I want to say it. So, if I want to say it, I got to eat it. Mmm. Mmm. I can feel my intestines boiling right now. No. All right. Chalupa. Boom, down. Hard taco. Boom, down. Two sections of the trilupa. Down. What do I got left? Soft shell taco. The last portion of the trilupa. Y'all can't go. I gave y'all what y'all wanted. Y'all said, come on here, eating. Marty McFly. Let me tell you something about Pizza Hut. It tastes like cardboard. Okay. It tastes like cardboard to me. Um, 
I don't like Pizza Hut. And y'all trying to get me all the foods is fattening. Marty McFly, you come up with something else. You do a cucumber uh, mukbang or carrots. Or a mixture of fruits and veggies. Tell me that. Because y'all, I, I can't do stuff that's going to hurt me now. Y'all want to hurt me. So, excuse me. That was rude. Excuse me. Okay? Yandu? Are you over here licking up shredded cheese off a of foot? Girl, I'm not, I'm taught you better than that. So, y'all, this is the end of this video. I thank you guys so much for watching and for responding and telling me, you know, giving me feedback, telling me what you want, telling me what you like. I like that, you know what I'm saying? Because it gives me something to want to do and try and look forward to now. Marty McFly, I have not forgot. This dude, I don't know if you was throwing shade or if you was just really trying to help my hair situation. He was like, do a video on Miracle Drops. That's for hair growth. <laughs> he, said, he said, get that hair growing first. That's what you need to do. Marty McFly, I know I'm bald headed, honey. But guess what? I haven't always been bald headed. So just know. Just know your girl used to at one point have some real hair. Okay? We all go to, we all fall sometimes. We all fall. But we like what some say. We fall down when we get up. I'm coming back up, y'all. I'm coming back up. But what I like about, what I love about his comment is, I said, what do you want me to do? Try Miracle Drops. Boy. Okay, I'm going to try the Miracle Drops. But I couldn't find no Miracle Drops. I did find some Jamaican black castor oil, extra black, which is supposed to be also um, for growing your hair, strengthening your hair, and getting it back on track. So we're going to try that first, and then we'll try to find the Miracle Drops, the honey, because I want to see what they're working with, too. But, y'all, I thank you so much for watching me eat this Taco Bell. This is all I have left right here and here. I told y'all. I'm not a good mukbanger. That's why my channel is random. Uh, and I just come to you with whatever, whatever, what, you know, whatever, whenever. I also have another channel for those who do not know. It is called Watch Me Swatch 2, where it's just basically me swatching makeup. Me seeing what color makes up makeups look right for my skin tone. And that's pretty much it. So I really do appreciate you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.